So it seems that, uh, that uh, Joe Meister has shot him all dead. Otherwise known as all fish. It's kind of like crawfish or crawdad. But there's no cr cr We continue this hunt. In case you were wondering, he shot it with the bow in his hand. Something's been here. Day two of the hunt. It's still the same day. We're still looking for the all dead. We're hoping it's all dead. <coughs> so it appears that the Axis powers have dropped their horns. Must be somewhere in the trees. That's where I'd look anyway. Alright, so we found some tracks. It's definitely a it appears that the uh, odd dad had uh, acquired some wheels after it had gotten shot and it's now going to seek emergency medical attention somewhere nearby to stop the bleeding from the arrow um, so we're here at the fence line and uh, there appears to be a disturbance in the air it might just be that I shit my pants and rubbed it on the back of my thighs. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, this is the 50 millionth time I've seen one of these. This is getting weird. We're still walking along the fence line. And, uh... It appears that there's just a, a clearing going straight down that way. Just completely clear where I can walk. I suspect. There's an accumulation of uh, water uh, fornicating right here. So, uh, I believe that could be tied to the Audad mystery. In our search for an Audad, we've found ourselves a regular dad. Did you see any Audad? Look what we got here. Seems to be a body of a dead albino tiger. Let's take a closer look. Upon further inspection, it is not a. Uh, Dead albino tiger, it is a rock. Yeah. So, oh, it appears we have run into another fence line. Something about this tells me that the guys, some guys, are trying to keep something in. Like an alive albino tiger. Or an all dad. I managed to acquire some sick wheels. Chase after the all dead in his sick wheels. It seems that I've been cut off for the, from the rest of the crew. Now usually I'd just sit down and scream until my mother arrived. But that's not the case this time. I'm gonna have to find my way back to the North Pole. There is uh, ten minutes into uh, being lost, and I'm already uh, insane from uh, starvation of water. You're not my dad. Get away from me. This is the, about the fourth time I've turned left, and I am going the same exact way as I was earlier. I don't know how many times I have to turn left to go somewhere different. Fifteen minutes have gone by, and I've suffered uh, several wounds to my ankles. And my leg organ hurts now. Ugh. It's starting to really, really, um, really smell. This is starting to smell real bad. So I was standing a lot farther away from from this uh, when I was uh, back there. I was a lot farther away, and uh, I thought it was just a field of dead albino tigers. But 
Uh, it's all rocks. It's just all rocks. I, can't, I couldn't believe it. There's no, more water uh, con um, congregate, congregating here. I um, wonder what they're uh, talking about. Times are getting desperate, so I'm going to have to um, implement my distress call. I'm out here completely unarmed. I'm afraid I'm gonna get charged by a hog. I'd like to see that thing, that mother, that mo mother try. I'm gonna wait here till they find me. Maybe if I uh, crouch down, they'll see me better. I uh, hope they see me and uh, my camo doesn't blend in too well with the background, otherwise they will run over me. I'm back here in the uh, Polaris. We didn't, didn't find the uh, all dad, but I'm safe and not dead. <laughs> <laughs> 